Hello, my brand new students, and welcome to our session today. Today's session is about grammar, present continuous. And before starting, I will ask you to open your Macmillan English book, Unit 1, Lesson 4. Let's start. Present continuous tense. What is the present continuous tense? Let's see. We use it to talk about actions and things that are happening now or at the moment. For example, can you see this cute cat? What is it doing? It is standing. Can you see this picture? What the, is the cat doing? It is running. The third one. It is sitting. The last one. It is sleeping. So now, how to make a sentence using the present continuous tense? Do you know how? Let's see together. The first step to make a sentence using present continuous, we write the personal pronouns. Do you remember the personal pronouns? They are seven. Excellent. Let's see them. I, you, he, she, it, we, they. So, what is the step number one? We write the personal pronouns. Like I, you, he, she, it, we, they. Let's see the step number two. Step number two, we add verb to be. So, after the personal pronouns, I add verb to be. To make it easy, I made this as a story. The story of Mrs. B. Mrs. B, she's a woman and she's pregnant. She has three babies. Let's see who they are. The first baby is baby M. The second baby is baby is. The third baby, baby R. So, Mrs. B, she has three babies, baby M, baby is, baby R. Do you remember, baby M catches what? Excellent, I, so we say, I am. Baby is, catches Three personal pronouns. Do you know them? Excellent. He and she and at. Baby R. It catches we, you, they. Let's revise. I catches baby M. You catches baby R. He catches baby is. She catches baby is. It catches baby is, we catches baby are, they catches baby are. So we say, I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, we are, they are. Let's move to the step number three. We add the verb. The verb here means action, something I do. For example, do you know what is this man doing? Excellent. Paint. What are they doing? Excellent. Swing. Play. Draw. Cook, cry, swim, <laughs> dance. So, step number one, we add personal pronoun, 
Step number two, we add the babies of verb to be. Step number three, we add the verb. Let's move to the step number four. Step number four, we add ing to the verb. So, let's imagine that. If we have a baby, what does the baby need? Excellent. Feeding bottle, ing. Feeding bottle, ing. Remember, present continuous form, personal pronouns like I, he, she, it, we, you, they, then we add verb to be, we call it Mrs. B, and she has three babies, am, or is, or are, then we add verbs, action verbs, then we add ing. We name it the feeding bottle, ING. Let's have an example. I am teaching. Pronouns, verb to be, verb ING. So, do not forget that. When we see a baby of verb to be before the verb, we add ing so there is a baby of verb to be i have to put ing again when we see a baby a verb to be i have to put ing to the verb let's now it's a practice time what are they doing let's see play Okay, can you remember what we do to make a sentence in present continuous tense? First, we add personal pronoun. Then we add baby, a verb to be. Then we write the action verb, playing. So, there is a baby, a verb to be, I have to put. ING to the verb. They are playing. They are playing. For example, here. What is she doing? What is she doing? What is the first step? Do you remember? Excellent. The personal pronoun. What is the step number two? Amazing. We add a baby of verb to be. So, it's time to say what is she doing. Dance. Then we will add ing. So, there is a baby of verb to be. Don't forget to put ing. She is dancing. She is dancing. Personal pronouns, baby or verb to be, verb ing. Let's complete our practice together. What is she doing? What is she doing? Can you guess? Excellent. She is singing. She is singing. As we said before, we first put the subject or the personal pronoun, then we add the baby of verb to be, then we put the verb plus ing. So, there is a baby of verb to be, I have to put ing. Let's move to the second question. What is it doing? What is it doing? Can you see? Excellent. It is eating. It is eating. Now it's time for the Macmillan English book.
Look at this. Grammar. Uncle Bob is watching TV. Aunt Mick is reading an email. Uncle Bob is watching TV. Can you see where is Uncle Bob? There he is. What is he doing? He is watching TV. Where is Aunt Meg? Can you see her? Yes, there she is. What is she doing? Aunt Meg is reading an email. Uncle Bob is asking a question. What are you doing, Freddy? What are you doing, Freddy? Can you see where is Freddy and what is he doing? There he is. What is he doing? Excellent. Drawing. I am drawing. Freddy answer. I am drawing. These girls say they are having fun. They are having fun. Yes, we are having fun. Yes, we are having fun. Circle the correct answer. Look at this picture. Number one. Is she making a cake? Is she making a cake? No, she isn't. No, she isn't. Number two. Is he eating a sandwich? Is he eating a sandwich? Look at the picture. And the answer. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Number three. Are they watching TV? Are they watching TV? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Number four. Are you drawing a picture, Freddy? Are you drawing a picture, Freddy? Can you see what is Freddy doing? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Ask and answer. What is he doing? What is he doing? He is reading a newspaper. He is reading a newspaper. Okay, it's time to ask and answer for this picture alone. Number one. What is he doing? What is he doing? Excellent. He is reading a book. He is reading a book. Number two. What are they doing? What are they doing? They are eating a cake. They are eating a cake. Number three. What is she doing? What is she doing? She is drawing a picture. She is drawing a picture. Number four. What are they doing? What are they doing? They are watching TV. They are watching TV. It's time for the practice book. So I will ask you to open it. Page number six. Read and match. 
What we are going to do? We are going to read these sentences from 1 to 6. Then we will look at the picture below and match it together. Let's see exercise number 1. It's done for you. She is eating an apple. Can you see which picture from A to F? Excellent. F. She is eating an apple. Number two. They are riding their bikes. They are riding their bikes. Look at the pictures. Which one they are riding their bikes? Excellent. Letter E. Letter E. Okay. Number three. He is blowing up a balloon. He is blowing up a balloon. Which one he is blowing up a balloon? Excellent. Letter D. Letter D. Number four. I am reading a book. I am reading a book. Letter A. Letter A. Number five. We are watching TV. We are watching TV. Excellent. Letter C. Letter C. Number six. He is sleeping. He is sleeping. Amazing. Letter B. Letter B. Complete the sentences with M, is, or are. Number one. Space, you are making a cake. Space, you are making a cake. Could you remember you catch as what? Am, or is, or are. Can we say, am you making a cake? Mm -mm. It's not correct. Let's try again. Can we say, is you making a cake? Is it correct? No. Let's try again. Are you making a cake? Yes. Excellent. Are you making a cake? Yes, I. I catches what? Am or is or are. Amazing. Am. Yes, I am. Number two. Ben and Sam. Ben and Sam equal they. So, they catches what? Am, is or are. They are many. Excellent. Are. Ben and Sam are swimming. Ben and Sam are swimming. Number three. Nina space writing an email. Nina is a girl. It equals she. And she catches am or is or are. Excellent. Is. Nina is writing an email. Number four. Space you having fun. Space you having fun. You catches. Or. Are you having fun? Yes, we. We catches what? Am, is, or are. Excellent. Are. Yes, we are. Now, look and write one sentence about each picture. Picture number one. Can you see what is he doing? Excellent. He is playing. He is playing. Number two. Can you see what she is doing? 
She is eating. She is eating. Number three. Can you see? What are they doing? They are sleeping. They are sleeping. This is the end of our session. I hope you enjoyed our lesson today. It's time to say goodbye.